Do you want to disagree with somebody who is more powerful than you? For example, your boss, your parents, or even a partner? Well, here's an eight-step guide to speak up and disagree with confidence. Number one, relax. You're probably feeling a lot more anxious than you should be. So think about the risk of not speaking up instead. Will it be better or will it be worse for you? Number two, timing is key. Discuss the issue with other people and see if they agree with your point of view. Don't have the discussion until you are well prepared. Number three, find common ground. Ask yourself, what does the other person care about? Connect your disagreement to a shared goal. What you need to think about is chess game, not boxing match. Number four, ask for permission. Give the other person control to make them feel safe and to make yourself feel confident. Say something like, I have concerns about the deadline for this project. Can I please share my thoughts? Number five, stay neutral, breathe. A slow and calm voice equals confidence, even if you don't feel it. Number six, acknowledge and build. Use facts, not judgments. For example, you can say, hey, we haven't hit four deadlines like this before. Instead of, hey, you're overworking us by giving us so many deadlines. Number seven, think aloud. This just might be me, but I'm really worried about X, Y, and Z. This opens the door for discussion and leaves a lot of room for the other person to contribute their views. Number eight, show respect. Make it known that you know that the other person has the final say. No backtracking or giving fake compliments. Now, disagreeing can be such a powerful tool in your career. Use this to build trust, to advance ideas, and to be heard and respected. You got this.